The power and symbolism of colors is known for decades. A splash of color has a deep, profound effect on our senses. It is natural that we humans get attracted to lively and vibrant colors that influence our brains. The same goes for the beauty of nature. The mountains and the beautiful color landscapes influence people who visit from around the globe. The temptation to visit rises when we see these cities and towns are painted with the beauty of shades that fascinate people more towards them. When we talk about the most colorful cities in the world, we can say that they are dominated by their incredible color-coordinated streets, uniquely designed buildings, and multicolor roads which help them in standing out from the boring cities. Here we are speaking about some stunning, colorful, and livable cities in the world to visit. Number 15. Tobermory, Scotland Tobermory is the city that is colorful in every possible sense of the word. It is situated on the west coast of Scotland with pastel-colored houses. The city has only 900 people who reside there. The colorful pastel-colored houses are with the seafront that attracts more people. And it's different because every city has used the bright or vibrant color themes. But this place used the pastel colors to look the city and place unique in its own way. On number 14, we have Gamesheon Village, South Korea. This must-to-visit village is situated in Busan City, which is coastal Busan in South Korea. It was once depicted as the cultural village and marked as a safe haven for refugees of the Korean War. It has colorful streets and buildings, which has the city's own theme known as Dreaming of Busan Machu Picchu. The artists who painted the city with this theme have their own unique thoughts and ideas to paint the walls and buildings differently and in the more unique idea that attracted the tourist. On number 13, we have Puerto de la Cruz, Spain. This city is located in the northern region of Spain's island of Tenefari. The city has a major history and is a significant value for tourism now and even in the early 1950s. The buildings are painted in vibrant colors and bright colors, red, yellow, shocking pink, along with the doors of the houses that have small illustrations on them, which have family surnames of who lived there or living there. Their names are carved beautifully. It is the most favorite tourist destination for its culture, beauty, and nightlife. On number 12, we have Chief Shawen, Morocco. This small city is located in the Rif Mountains, which are on the northwestern side of Morocco. Due to the spiritual belief, most of the city is painted in blue color, which represents heaven and the sky color. This gives the different shade at different times of the day with sunlight, and at night the colors have their own beauty. Though, according to some residents, the walls were to be painted blue only to fascinate tourists at some point in the 1970s. On number 11, we have Zalipi, Poland. It is known as the Painted Village and is located in Poland's Mina Umiso. The houses are painted colorful but with the floral designs on it and it doesn't include black color much. The houses are made up of different materials as compared to normal buildings. The Lippi, one of the painted houses, is now a museum that represents their local culture. On number 10, we have Jaipur, India. It is Rajasthan, but also known as Rajasthan's second largest city, and people call this city the Blue City. It is called a Blue City because it differentiates the city of Brahmins from other castes and classes of people in India, and also because of all the houses in the area are painted with the sky blue color. Jaipur is a famous sightseer destination, highlighting many beautiful huge palaces, forts, and temples set in the stark landscape of the Thar Desert. Despite the hot summers, Jaipur is highly recommended to visit to experience the zest of Indian culture. On number 9, we have St. John's, Canada. What a beautiful city St. John's is! It is well known as the coldest place in Canada. The city consists of the multicolored houses, which are also sometimes called the jelly bean row houses. 
The interesting part about this city is that each house is painted so vibrantly that it becomes difficult for the tourists to take their eyes off of them. This is one of the best experiences of my traveling to see and appreciate nature in all its glory. On number 8, we have Guanajuato, Mexico. It is situated in central Mexico. The houses of Guanajuato fall down over the mounts that encircle them in amusing color. This city is famous because of these houses, which are painted using three major colors, red, saffron, and green lime. If you are planning to visit a tourist-friendly country and would like to see a breathtaking view, then you should decide to take the aerial view of the city. It is definitely the most beautiful city in Mexico. On number seven, we have Colmar, France. Colmar is situated in the Alsace region. Colmar is known for its colorful houses, ancient architecture, and historic museums. There is an old house that is painted differently in red, pink, yellow, green color, and all the houses are adjacent to each other, so one cannot just skip the colorfulness from sightseeing. The houses are painted again on Christmas or Easter and other holidays, so colors got refreshed and looked even more attractive. Colmar is worth visiting when all you need is a splash of colors and wants to make wonderful memories. On number six, we have Varena, Italy. It is not such a famous place. It is actually a small town situated beside Lake Cuomo, which is located in the province of Lico. The city has bright yellow and vibrant red color buildings houses, which becomes the center of attraction for the tourists. Since the city is based on some canals, therefore tourists can easily use ferries for commute purposes. On number five, we have Havana, Cuba. Havana is the capital city of Cuba, and the city has colorful buildings as well as colorful cars. It is also known as the rich Havana. From beautiful park views to tasting some delectable Cuban food, the city will make your trip a memorable one. My advice is to visit Havana and surround yourself with colors to change your mood. On number four, we have Guatape, Colombia. It is located in Colombia's Antioquia department. This city has bright colored tile buildings that somehow represent a unique value position, which also perfectly depicts the culture of that area. Every building in the city consists of multiple signs, shapes, or animal designs that help in understanding the value of the place. The place is a great attraction to the visitors because they can easily get the bird's eye view of the place from a hilltop. I recommend Kayak Boat Ride, a must do in the calm waters of Guatape. My other favorite budget friendly recommended things in Guatape include a walk full of serenity around the fine decorated street with some real photogenic moments to capture. Don't forget to eat some great local food they master and also energize yourself with the rich colors of Guatape, with their traditional rich dark coffee that is a must to have. On number three, we have Menton, France. We cannot deny the fact that Menton is a unique tourist location with some pretty and colorful places to visit. It has a light color building, not so vibrant, and a garden beside them, which contributes to increasing the beauty of the city for local people as well as for the tourists. We suggest Menton France is worth visiting for a day stopover at least. On number two, we have Copenhagen, Denmark. Copenhagen is the most colorful place in the harbor district of Nyhaven. There are beautifully colored houses with the canal, which has wooden ships that obviously increase the beauty of the place. It is well known because of the oldest house that was built in 1961. Apart from the painted houses, the streets and pathways of Denmark are colored with eye-catching shades, which could easily leave the tourist awestruck. Copenhagen is a unique city, categorized by its scenic water canals, biking trends, stable economic system, and contented residents. It is also known as the happiest city in the earth due to its short work timings, free academic fee, holiday and trip leaves. Though we have all the reasons to call it the luckiest city too. 
On number one, we have Buerno, Italy. The effects of color on emotions have been a topic of interest for years. This is when we choose to visit this beautiful, full of color city, Buerno. Buerno is a pretty village on the island that has an abundance of colorful, gaily painted houses that make it quite a famous place all around the world. Their houses were brushed in light neutral colors in dim lights, and as the darkness moved, they became more vibrant. Locals of this small town, located in the Venetian Lagoon in northern Italy, says that Buerno is so colorful because fishermen reside here and they use the bright, attractive painted houses as a symbol to find their way to their homes when fog overspreads in the island. Interestingly, all the houses in this pretty village are situated beside the canal that increases its beauty and water of the canal has a reflection of the sky that turns out the color of the canal greenish, which attracts the tourists. It is amusing to know that the primary economy of Buerno is tourism that is much appreciated. It's no wonder that this vibrant city is well worth a few extra days to visit. There is certainly no denying the fact that this world is full of beautiful colors that can leave you in awestruck. We are totally impressed with the colors and beauty of this world.